So here we have the new 5 by 160 mil coupler. Uh, one of colleagues here has been commissioning this over the last 24 hours, testing all its positions uh, and making sure it's really ready for a hot swap with the old unit that's behind it. Uh, we're quite happy that it's all good to go. Uh, the, the, the new coupler builds on the foundations of the old one. We haven't hugely changed it, but there's been modifications, improvements in the materials. But uh, this is ready to go in and give another 20 plus years of service. But we go around here, we can see the, the old one. And we can see the old one, we've already got some of the preparation work going on there, but it looks very much the same other than the fact it's dirty, it's worn. 20 years, 24 hours a day, seven days a week service. New ones are ready to go. We've got it in a fairly close proximity to it. Uh, when we continue to run our backup system for a little bit longer, we'll switch this system off completely, disconnect the electrical connections, disconnect all the mechanical tube work, so then out with the old, in with the new. We've got some fairly quick, swift connections uh, for the mechanical tube work back and front. A little bit of electrical connection a colleague there will pick up on. And while that's happening, most importantly for the hospital, everything still works, the system still works. And the way we're able to do that is because of the works we did earlier in the year, which is behind us here, what, um, what looks like a spaghetti of tubes is actually a backup system. So these diverter units, three of them on the wall here, and these loops of tube, effectively make sure there's a link between each of the five zones. So every zone can send the carrier from one zone to the other. In fact, I don't know if you pick up the, the audio there, but that was one passing through one of those links now, because we've got it in service test. So as I say, the system still runs. We haven't got the storage that we've got on a coupler, so this isn't uh, as good as the, the linear coupler, but it's certainly adequate for the one hour period while we transfer the two over. Or indeed, when the new one's in place and the engineers need to do maintenance on it, or if there's any issues with it. With the, the backup system there, you could do maintenance on, say, just this one valve here. I set that one valve and the backup will pick up just that one element or one of the storages down below. So it's a, it's not just good for the work we're now doing, it's a legacy after our work for all the maintenance and such like going forward, should they have issues or just for routine BPM maintenance. So, so yeah, next thing as I say is we'll make sure this backup's all doing as it should and then we'll shut down the old coupler ready to get it out of place.